I have been listening to a video on the internet from Alfie Boy, uh, the guy that sings now with Michael Ball. And I love this song that he sings. It's called Run, R U N, Run, you know, like you run. And the words of the songs are beautiful. When he sings that song, I compare it with Dr. Steve Pitts, the psychiatrist that got murdered in Arizona. I feel like it's Dr. Pitts' words singing. And I'm going to tell you why. If you look at all the details about this, the, the data of Dr. Steve Pitts, you see this man the having it in gray is a fake picture but it's kind of a shabby looking face um and i'm gonna i'm gonna uh, do the comparison here at the end of this video this tape um in year 2008 i had a house invasion uh, i would say i was kidnapped to jail for a week only a week and a lot of things were going on in the house in the home I was renting to buy I had a lot of collectibles there and I had I couldn't bank back then so I had probably close to ten thousand dollars less probably less than ten thousand dollars I didn't even know how much I had but I, with confederal bills it was over that it was about twelve hundred I mean twelve thousand I mean twelve thousand dollars and um, uh, when I came back from, from jail, and this was because I was driving with a suspended driver's license. When I came back, um, I had a video where the house looks like there was a tornado went through it. Some people went in, and especially neighbor next door. And the whole, the whole place was searched through. And I didn't have it like that. It, it was a big house, uh, a two-story house. And uh, the people that were in there or the person that was in there, they went through everything. I mean, it was, you see that it's, it's scary. Everything was, uh, it just looked like a tornado went through. Uh, all the money was gone. I had cash there. Oh, cash, like, like I said, uh, probably close to it. Uh, it, it you know, eleven, twelve thousand dollars in, considering the Confederate bills that I've some of for them, I pay five hundred dollars each. So, before that, they were saying to me uh, that few months before, I didn't have no power and electricity, so the house froze up. Uh, Excel Energy sent me a bill suddenly. I was paying my electric bill, which is like two hundred dollars, a hundred and something. But suddenly I was sending a bill for almost $6,000, like over $5,000, and the bill was a scam. Anyway, uh, uh, Excel Energy was resisting that um, to fix up that bill that was wrong. Even a woman that I talked to in Excel Energy told me that that, that bill didn't smell good, that was something... I mean, she was honest enough, even though she was scared to tell me that. She said, this is, this is fishy. This is something uh, very strange because there was no sense to it. And there was a story behind it that was not truth. So I was getting bills for another people that live in places I live. So my power got disconnected and there was no way to make an arrangement for the Excel energy to turn it back on. They wanted the they wanted over five thousand dollars, so somebody was leading this. Some, some person was leading Excel Energy to do that to me, and I want to know who that person was. So anyway, going back to the song um, of uh, Alfie Boy, that reminds me of Steve Pitts. Maybe this case went all the way to Steve Pitts. He knew about it, but Alfie Boy sings that song. He says light up light up light up see and uh that was the case to start with if i would have a good attorney 
But everything started, I mean, that was part of the problem. I was desperately driving with a suspended driver's license. I had no power, it was winter, and I only had depend on a neighbor next door that took advantage of the situation. Before, before the smashdown came to me and I was, I was uh, done a house invasion and I was done very, very cruel, there was a set of cops that stood up I mean, they park in front of my next neighbor door. And I say, I wonder why these cops are standing. They park in there. One was like this, and the other one was like this. Like they park, you know, when they're two. And they were just right in front of the person that was going to steal all my money. And this is before that I was put in jail for, for, um, for uh, a week, you know, eight days. So anyway, um, when I hear the song, light up, light up.